Welcome back to That Dad Guy. It's Sunday, April the 17th, 2022, and here it's Easter Sunday, so uh, it's a good day for family time, good day for chocolate, good day for being off work, hopefully wherever you are. If you're not celebrating Easter, hopefully you at least have a day off work, uh, where it's Sunday, or uh, getting some time to yourself and relax, or family time, or whatever makes you happy. Today, I'm gonna write some postcards. I have one official that I can send out, and I've got a couple swaps. It's down a lot more than uh, I have done in the previous Sundays, but that's okay. It was a short week, and next week's a short uh, mail week, so uh, in the next couple weeks may not be as many cards going out, but uh, that'll give me a break from uh, writer's cramp and postage uh, <laughs> uh, that we're sending out. And uh, hopefully uh, it's not uh, quantity, but quality. So I'll show you what I've got to send. I want to say thank you for liking, subscribing, and commenting. And uh, if you haven't checked out uh, some of the latest videos, go back and check them out. I've been putting out a lot the last few days and uh, varied content. So uh, yeah, enjoy. So my first official one I have is going to go to Germany. And it's going to a woman named Lisa. Uh, she is perfect for what she uh, wants to send because... It is different, and that's what I like. It's not all just uh, tourist cards that people are looking for or flowers. In this case, she's asking for the ugliest card you have and never dared to send it to anybody until now. Where did you get it and why? That's a great opening uh, card to send to somebody. She also likes cards with lots of blue and green or bright yellow. She likes uh, ones that have uh, reading or laughing people on them. Zodiac cards, food package, self-made cards, uh, birds, bizarre stuff, cards from my favorite galleries, uh, greeting cards from, and she lists a whole bunch of different countries. Um, so there's a whole bunch of different ones here. She says she doesn't like the typical tourist cards. So if you have them, send them to someone else who will enjoy them. And uh, no old, old cards or with, uh, with the yellow back. She doesn't like the feel of the paper. So that's always good to know too. So I have picked out this card as a strange or an oddity one. It is from the new uh, Dungeons and Dragons uh, card pack that I bought that had uh, 100 cards, but 50 different ones. And uh, this is a cover from uh, uh, one of the ones that, uh, one of the books that came out. <clears throat> so hopefully she likes it. It's a very strange card to send on Easter Sunday, but uh, yeah, to each their own. She may enjoy this, so that's why I picked that one up specifically for her, and uh, hopefully she will. Now, I have this card going out to someone, talking about uh, rust-proof corsets. So every pair is guaranteed. I thought it was just kind of a funny, old-timey card. So that one is going out to someone. The signs of spring. So we have this bird and the nice uh, blossom tree, little cherry blossom perhaps. Um, this one is going out outside now uh, with the way the weather has been. We've gotten lots of rain. It's raining today again. Um, the weather is kind of up in uh, the high single digits or double digits. So yesterday was about 14 degrees. Today I think is going to be about 9 degrees. But the trees actually have started to uh, get some little buds on them where the leaves will be in the future. So I will show you those on a sunny day. And uh, the grass is starting to turn green and the tulips are up. So I thought this one is perfect as a reminder that spring is finally here, at least in Moncton. I hear that some places like the Prairie Provinces are getting snow. So uh, unfortunately to them, uh, they have to wait a little bit longer. Now this card is going out. I love this one. This is the old Batman show and the old um, vehicles that went with it. So I am hoping this is going to someone who will appreciate the old Batman as well. And this is uh, Batman uh, from the comic books from 1943. But it is uh, very reminiscent too of the show from the 60s that was out. And this one I just thought is um, beautiful in its simplicity. When you have the reflection in the water of the tree and so I'm sending this someone to someone who is artsy and uh, hopefully will be able to appreciate it too and maybe they can even duplicate it uh, in one of their art pieces now this one is a 3d card Saint-Tropez I received a 3d card this week and I got these 3d cards in a parcel. If you go back, you may see that one. The last big unboxing I had came from Lithuania, and uh, this was one of the cards that uh, was sent to me there by Sky Yesya. So, uh, 
hopefully they will enjoy those. So that is all I've got today. I've got five swaps to do, one official one to do. And uh, so six cards are going to go out. Now, there's no mail today. It's Sunday. There's no mail tomorrow because it's uh, Easter Monday, so it's kind of a bank holiday. And uh, government offices and things like that are closed, so there's no mail delivery. So these won't actually hit the mail um, to travel until Tuesday. So um, we'll get them up to, done today, but I won't be walking out to the mailbox in the rain at the end of this video. So I'm just going to do these cards up, and that'll be it. So... <laughs> No point in me coming back on and showing you what there is. I don't like to show you the backs of the cards and things, as you know. But I do want to say uh, thank you for tuning in and watching all these videos. Um, go watch the train video if you haven't. That was yesterday's. Uh, that Daddy Guy Answers was out yesterday. So I put up two videos yesterday. Um, so hopefully, you'll, if you haven't seen them, you'll go check them out. And um, Ukrainian stamps. I'm still looking to, for people to send them to me. I know I have some on the way. Uh, so there'll be at least another video for it. But if you can find any Ukrainian stamps, and it'll have to be mint ones. I know a lot of people have been sending mint ones, and that's great. But uh, they can be used. Um, if you're from the Ukraine and you want to reach out to me, that would be excellent. I would love that. Um, maybe we can even set up a swap or something like that, depending on how we can get mail to you. I know mail is getting out and coming to Canada from the Ukraine. I'm not sure how much of it is going back in. Um, but yeah, reach out to me, robertlennox at gmail.com. Or uh, if you're on Instagram and you have me there at uh, Rob Lennox on Instagram, send me a direct message there and I'll give you an address. So that's what we can do. And uh, other than that, stay safe. What follow? You say like, subscribe, share, and tell all your friends. Who's a good boy? Who's a good boy?